We're going to do two quick examples involving adding and subtracting algebraic expressions. If you're asked to find the sum of 3x squared plus 2x and negative 5x squared plus x, you must remember that when you're asked to find the sum of two things, you're being asked to add them together. So this is what you're being asked to calculate. And you're going to do it in the same way you always have when you're adding or subtracting an algebra, you need to look for like terms. So we're going to identify the like term that goes with that. And we're going to identify the like term that goes with that. And then we simply go and add. So 3x squared, add to, onto it negative 5x squared, is going to give you 3x squared, subtract 5x squared, which is just going to be minus 2x squared. And then you're going to have 2x and you're going to add to it x and so you will get 3x. Okay, if I'm given this question to do where I need to subtract 2x minus y plus 4 from 5x minus y plus 2, then what I first need to do is make sure I get my subtraction the right way around. Note that I'm subtracting or taking away this from this. So I start with this, right? So I start with the 5x minus y plus 2, and the thing that I subtract from it is this, minus 2x minus y plus 4. And here are a couple of things that will help you. Just make sure that you actually put these expressions into brackets when you're working with them, and you then very, very carefully emphasize the fact that you've got a subtraction because the important thing is it's the whole of this this 2x minus y plus 4 that you are subtracting from that so this subtraction applies to everything inside that bracket and that's important and it's very easy to forget that so let's sort it out 5x minus y plus 2. You're going to subtract 2x, but then have a look here. You're going to subtract, and you've got subtracting a minus y, which is going to give you plus y, and then the subtraction also applies to the 4, so you're going to get subtract 4. Now we've just got to identify our like terms. and then go ahead and sort it out. 5x minus 2x is 3x. Minus y plus y gives you 0, so I don't need to write on anything. And 2 minus 4 is minus 2. And so we have got our answer 3x minus 2.